he can be as a 20 plus and 10 guy. For now, though, this is the lineup for the Wolves, and they win the opening tip. Ben, he can play both sides of the ball. We've seen it. This is Williams, the rookie, off the early 6-5 advantage for the Wolves. Crossover, McDaniels outside. Anderson makes the catch. Gobert, little Euro in traffic. Put <laughs> it in the foul. Too long on the J. That little smile out of P.J. Washington after the move. Ball leaves it for Williams, who throws it down. Mike shot over 36% in Utah this year in five attempts per game. Edwards driving, can't throw it down. Nice contest from Mark Williams, but he picks up the foul. You know what I mean? Like, it's a novelty sometimes, and when you're rolling, that's a time to do that. But when you're trying to get into a basketball game, just give it up to the ball handler and go run the floor. It's a novelty sometimes, and when you're rolling, that's a time to do that. But when you're trying to get into a basketball game, just give it up to the ball handler and go run the floor. Ball for three. Then it's stolen. Hornets the other way, trying to take advantage off the turnover. Rozier the miss. Hayward gets it back. Ball for three. Hornets the other way, trying to take advantage off the turnover. Rozier the miss. Hayward gets it back. Ball for three. No. Oh, my. The follow dunk from Mark Williams. Williams. Height advantage on McDaniels and scores easily. Minnesota's best scorer right now. Who's Minnesota's second best scorer? Talked about that. But Answer the question is, is that our second best scorer is sitting in street clothes on the bench. It has been since November 28th. Conley rims out. Edwards driving. Great defense. Anderson got a paw on it. Pressure in this final 240. Edwards has come alive. Here's Anderson over to McDaniels. Too long on the three. Conley has to give it up. Edwards on the move inside. Blocked. Washington comes out of there with it, and a foul is called on Kyle Anderson. Rebound Hayward. 